Ta-da! What's up, guys? What's up, guys? So, today we are going to be installing this Baja Designs rock light as a dome light in our E30. Um, now, I will qualify this by telling you that it's going to be a little bit easier install for me because if you watched the last video, I hired a pro to do all my wiring in the car, a process which I could not film, I could not show you. We went ahead and wired a dome light in. He just didn't share my aesthetic values and put this kind of cheap chrome rimmed thing up there and I'm not happy with it. It works well. We wired it to 12 volt and down here to a rocker switch but um, honestly I just don't like how it looks so we're going to be putting in this nice slick Baja Designs rock light. So this Baja Designs rock light is actually pretty cool. We've got this sweet little LED light in a billet enclosure. Uh, what I really like about this though is it comes with this roll bar mount. So you can actually mount this thing to your roll cage. So for me, I can use it in the one location now and then when I put a roll cage in this car, we can move it. Slick. It comes with all the hardware you need as well as zip ties um, for the roll bar mount but we're not going to be using the zip ties or the roll bar mount because we're mounting it another way so you can see we've got this cheap little chrome rim dome light it works well but it looks cheesy so we're going to replace it with this little number so first thing to do is disconnect the battery simple one handed operation Then we're going to pop down this little unit here. Uh, it's like the little notification panel. I know there's a proper term for it. I can't think of it. So we're just going to unscrew the bolts that held this one in place. Pop it out. Cut the wire and move to the workbench. We're going to be installing it in this notification center thing, warning light, little area. So, since we had another um, dome light in place, the guy had drilled it out before and obviously made a big hole in the center because of the way the other one was wired. This one doesn't need that. Thankfully, it covers my spots. So, it's going to be a pretty installation for me. What we got to figure out though is where this wire goes. So for me, this is the top. I want the wire to be on the bottom so that we don't see it as much. So, so we're going to drill these holes out. Feed the wire through. Oops, down here. Now, what I'll probably do in the end is put a little silicone down there to block it off. So the light comes with washers and nuts. I don't want to go too tight because I don't want to break the plastic. There you have it. We'll put some uh, 
a little bit of gunk there to cover that up. Let's go put this in the car. Guys, our Baja Designs Rock Light is in. Looks awesome, super bright, nice and clean. Goes with the black flag aesthetic. Uh, so I'm excited about it. I'm really excited about this car, guys. I think it looks really great. Super slick setup here. Um, what's next? I guess next I'll do a build breakdown of the outside of the car, show you everything I've got going on, and we'll tell you what's next. And drive it. I'm just going to drive this thing. How about that? Next is an alignment, and we're just going to drive it. So, uh, good stuff. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, and we'll see you soon.